Hey guys, Umber here. Just wanted to say that this episode, uh, as you can probably guess from the title, is not actually a continuation of the story from yesterday. It is um, basically the same stuff that you saw yesterday, the same puzzles, but uh, they updated the layout of the workshop. So I wanted to, to cover that because I wasn't expecting it and I didn't know that they were going to do that. So I went and had a little look around and made an episode out of it. So we'll... I do finish chapter one in this episode, so uh, keep watching for that, but otherwise it's more or less the same, so sorry about that. But tomorrow, Wednesday, we will do chapter two properly, I promise. Okay, I'll begin the episode now. What up, wimps? Welcome back to Horror Games Wimps, the show where I get scared so you get spared. My name is Zombie. Uh, I came to record some more Ben the Enigma Machine and I noticed that it uh, looked different. Um, not to be, you know, not surprising. Uh, chapter 4 came out yesterday when episode 1 did. And so uh, I thought, well, alright, they've, they've updated it for, for chapter 4 coming out, that's fine. But then I went to go and play and not only had it not saved my data from, from yesterday, but... Uh, I was walking around and things looked just a little bit different. Things were just a little bit dissimilar to what we saw in yesterday's video. So I thought what I'd do is I'd just go through this uh, episode one again. Uh, just see what the changes are, see if anything's different, see if anything's new, if we get any little oh, surprises. Joey. I'm here. Let's see if we can find what you wanted me to see. And, uh, yeah, if, if it turns out that nothing actually is that different, then I'll just cut straight to into episode two. But, yeah, you know, we'll have a little look around, see what's around here. And uh, this will be episode 1.5. So you can see there's already a difference here. These shutters weren't here in the original chapter one. And even with this output schedule, which is fun. 423, that is too many. Oh, little pipe here so now we actually need to use the space bar this lift could use a few dry cells and then this is all new so this is as far as i explored before realizing that you know everything was different so everything that we see from this point on is brand spanking new to me all right so there's one dry cell And there's the other. Let's see what you're hiding down there, old friend. So we got some new voice lines, which is fun. Uh, it makes me sad because if there's stuff in, you know, later on in chapter one, uh, and chapter two, and chapter three that was different, then I'm I'm never gonna know what that was. But uh, this is fun. I tell you what, though, that if that's the new ink machine, oh man, that is so much more impressive than the previous one. That's an ink machine worth writing home about. Okay, I can't jump. I guess I have to find my way down elsewhere. Ah, now the shutters are open. And so is this door. I don't know if this door was already ajar when I came down here. But with the exception of these curtains and Bendy being over here now, nothing seems too different. Uh, although there's no ink, there's no book, so... I'm guessing the pedestal stuff has been saved. Got some dots though. Oh, oh man, that's fun. The uh, don't look at that. Oh, bullseye. I'm the best. Uh, dots. That's fun. Uh, still good. Our soup is still safe, still secure. And is this area? Yeah, still locked off. Okay. Anything happen if I punch in yet? Another day, another dollar. Nope. Alright. Let's go through here and get to the ink machine. So this all looks more or less the same. <gasps> no! They got rid of the baby Bendy! Baby Bendy! We will miss you. Joey, what were you doing? The restraints are slightly, slightly more on Boris, it looks like. He's been secured to that table 
a bit harder, which is probably good. I didn't get to a point where Boris is inevitably chasing after us, but I don't doubt it happens. Ah, so the pedestals are still here. Locate and place the objects. All right, well, you already went to where I fought two of them were, and they're not there anymore. Hey, Bendy. <laughs> you know, it's stupid. I totally forgot that was going to happen. Oh, dear. All right. That's a that's a bone. Ugh. At this point, I don't care. All right, we've already we've already heard this before. We don't need that again. Get out of here, Wally. Ah, there's the bendy plush. Uh, okay. Oh, the pressure's evolved now. Not a button and the. Okay, so I'm just noticing these nice little changes. I already tried that though. I'm sorry. I'm a fool. All right, let's go back to down here then. Maybe, maybe there's more that I missed or something will have reappeared since I started this new quest. Is there a ah no, the book is there. All right, got the book, The Illusion of Living by Joey Drew. So I still need the wrench, which is around the corner. He will set us free. Ah, how do I crouch? Ah, don't need to. Let's get some tunes up in here. Tunes. It was only yesterday that I realized how weirdly I say that. I say that like a CH. Okay, the wrench was here, but now it's not here. Interessant. No cog here either. Really making me work for it now, aren't you, game? I'm not being spoon fed anything anymore. Oh, there's I Baby Bendy. Yay, Baby so Bendy. Looks Glad like he knocked out a wall or two after I left. Guess it took a few people to replace me. Yeah, it did, Henry. You're the man. Uh, what the frick is the everything I need? There's the ink. Okay. Still need a cog and a wrench. Neither are in the, uh, the places that they used to be. I feel like there should be something over here. Let's, uh, let's turn off the projector. Just because it gives me bad vibes. Right, I've explored this area. Theatre and the break room. You know, I thought there would have been a wrench inside that toolbox, but it was just a bone. And that ain't right. A lot of uh, a lot more atmosphere I've noticed as well. Like this, there's, there's creaking going on. It sounds like there's somebody walking around with me in here, which is holy fuck. Okay, that one actually scared me a little bit. So I guess. I guess that one gets a warning, because it actually it actually got a bit spooked. So it's a little mini jump scare, but it's a jump scare nonetheless, because I got myself a little bit of a startle. Done made myself afraid. Cog wrench. God damn it. I mean that you know, it's a workbench. It feels like there should be a wrench around here. That one in the garbage can. And because this is so new, there's not going to be any walkthroughs. I'm on my own. Por qué? Unless I've... Nope, I haven't just happened to have picked them up. That would be too convenient. Okay, well, yes. The cog in here, which I saw at the beginning of the game and really should have remembered. Okay, so now we're almost... Good, I just need the wrench. It's not down there. Stop <laughs> stop being tempted down there. I'm just gonna put the cog back and who knows, maybe the wrench will just appearify wherever I need it to be. Wouldn't that be nice? And I'm not being stupid, it's not like just here, is it? No. Okay. And I'm sure it was a bone in this box and not a wrench. And it looks pretty bone-like. I... F I don't know. I feel like the wrench is in this room because there's nothing else in here other than Boris. And... This feels like a wrenchy room. And yet... 
No wrench. God, it's like, I've probably walked past it like twice. And you're like, go back and look in the, under the sofa in the dorm. I'm like, there's no sofa, there's no dorm. Now who's the idiot? Maybe if I eat enough soup, the wrench will make itself known to me. Oh, it's this. No, that's, it's a toolbox. There might be a wrench inside, but it won't let me open it. The damn tease is what it is. I've already gone this way like three times. There's nothing. There's nothing here. There's nothing here. This is where the plush was. Because I found something in every room except for the Boris room. But there's just... There's nothing in the Boris room. More soup. I wonder if I can fashion a wrench out of soup. Make a soup wrench. I found something in this room, didn't I? Because if I didn't, then... Yes, I did. I found the, um... The doohickey. Yeah. Good work, Obby. Words are... Words are your forte. No, I found the ink. I found the ink in here. Bendy. Bendy, I will trade you five tins of bacon soup for the location of the wrench. It's where? <gasps> Thank you, Bendy. I'll be back with your soup pronto. Looks like the answer was inside us the whole time. Okay, that's all of them. And by inside us, I mean Boris. Thank you, Bendy. I will be back with your soup at some point in the future. Ha 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 ha! It was a ruse! The soup is all mine. Now I just need to get the ink flowing somehow. Should be a switch around here somewhere. Then I can start up the main power. But at least my instincts were right about it being in the Boris room. I just... <laughs> I didn't expect it to be in Boris. I don't think anyone of any of us really expected it to be in Boris. Alright, is this where you're gonna stick your head out at me now? Yeah. Ha <laughs> ha. I'm wise to your ways now, Bendy. Still no soup for you. No! It's my bacon soup. All right, now let's go see what this hip new machine looks like when it's turned on. Wait, how do I turn it on? I would have assumed. Wait, how do I turn it on? Did a door open or something? I feel like a door probably opened somewhere. That must be a switch. Okay, well, it's not that way because that's where the ink pressure was. It's presumably not where Boris is. Which means the break room? I don't think it's going to be in the theater. I guess we'll just go open doors. Well, uh, I guess this is an... Oh, here we go. Nope. That's just the AC, I think. I'm following the signs for the ink machine. And I get to where the ink machine be. There's no switches. No switches, no buttons. There's ink. But, I mean, we got that aplenty. I have to say, uh, chapter one of this game was... Uh, the instructions were a lot clearer. I just wasn't paying attention the first time around. Alright, Bendy, I know I've betrayed you in the past, but I will give you six tins of soup if you tell me how to turn on the ink machine. That's a whole... Six tins of soup for a little bit of information. Now that, that's a good deal. Is the answer in Boris's chest again? Oh wait, was it a button? I'm a goddamn fool is what I am. Absolute ding dong. All right, well, let's begin that fun old chase sequence again. Presumably that's what's happening next. Yep. All right. Ready, folks? Uh. Hello? I, I, I went towards you and you didn't begin the... The chase sequence. Okay. That's why. Okay, I just have to get a lot closer. 
so it's time to run. Am I being chased? You know what? I don't want to look. I don't want to know. I'll just assume I am. It's always best to assume that one is being chased by a giant ink demon. Okay, and away we go. Ow. I done broke myself. Okay. Okay. in need of constant repairs it would look like interessant must require a lot of upkeep so let's drain the pipes drain the ink by turning the pipes even. get rid of all this grimy ink Those my good suit pants it's gonna wear these on a hot date with one of them broads one of them hip cats. Now I gotta find my slacks. You're gonna pay for my dry cleaning bill, Mr. Drew. Clear a new path. Well, this will definitely come in handy. Yeah. Come at me now, ink demons. Ah, Dre's, you're playing a better game. Good job. You listen to me. I stop interrupting my recording. I don't know how to turn that off. Ooh. Ooh. That's not good. That's not good at all. Now I'm trapped. So. Look. Whoa! What the fresh fuck? What the fresh heckin'? Hello? Oh! Okay. So, um. Okay. I guess, uh, <laughs> we'll do chapter two tomorrow. I was not expecting it to be that short. But, there you go. So, uh, thanks for watching episode 1.5. Uh, I'm sorry for teasing you twice. I thought I, w I thought there was going to be an episode 2 happening. I really did. But no dice. So, thanks for watching this weird episode. Uh, sorry about the weird time stuff. And, yeah, it's all a bit of a mess. I should have done my research first. But then where's the fun in that? So, come back tomorrow for chapter 2. And until then, wimp.